Hello, everyone, and good morning, and welcome back to Mostly Farm. And today is the day we are going to go out there, you guys, and we are going to see our baby dinosaur, our baby dinosaur hatched last night. So let's go ahead and clear out our inventory. I am so absolutely thrilled to get a chance to see what the baby dinosaur looks like. Okay, we're going to look at the weather report really quickly. Ah, it's going to be cloudy tomorrow. Darn. I would love to upgrade the watering can, but there's probably not a lot of a point in doing that just yet. Oh, we've got some mail. Let's peek at the mail. <gasps> I see him. I see him. I see him. Okay, dear Siri, I know you're busy on the farm, and that's why you can't visit. I understand. You've been working so hard. Keep it up, and you can accomplish anything. Love, Dad. P.S. Included some quality stone. Okay, so our dad has sent us an awesome letter, and he has sent us some quality stone. We're not going to turn that down because we constantly need stone for lots and lots of upgrades. So we've got 30 stone now. And then let's see. Dear Siri, you're such a good neighbor. I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up from Marnie. Thank you, Marnie. So we have received uh, the gift of many things we already had from those two today, but that is just fine because today is a happy day. There's apparently an artichoke growing here. And you guys, it's Peepon. It's Peepon, the baby dinosaur. <gasps> look at it. Isn't it so cute? Oh my gosh, look at it. It is so preciously cute. It is so preciously cute. And yes, this is a modded dinosaur. I had a sneak peek of what the dinosaurs would look like. So I downloaded a new texture and this is our brand new baby dinosaur. I have to say I am extremely thrilled to have it too. So when this little guy grows up, it's just a little baby right now. But when it grows up into a bigger dinosaur, it will start laying eggs. And speaking of eggs, let's see if there's anything inside. One egg. I don't really blame the chickens. Perhaps waking up to find that there is a dinosaur in the, the like chicken coop kind of put them all off laying their eggs. So I'm okay with that. All right, let's put this away because the eggs make for great gifts to give to people. And what do we have here? We have some cranberry jelly. Wonderful. Well, okay. I kind of want to, I wish I could, mm, well, oh, oh, chickens, 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 sweet pea. <gasps> Look, sweet pea almost loves us five hearts. Oh my gosh, and there's Marigold, and there goes my dinosaur! My little dinosaur is just headed off into the cranberries. In fact, no, don't eat this cranberry. Just gather up these cranberries. Oh, we have a gold star cranberry. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I don't see it. Okay. Oh, wait, there it is. It's over by the corn. We have a little dinosaur running around in our corn. That is so much fun. Oh, wow. All right, and today we should also have the barn upgraded too, which is, I mean, look at Peapod. Peapod's playing in the cranberries and the corn. Peapod, you're amazing. I can't believe we have a dinosaur here on the ranch. Oh no, and I'm out of water. All right, well, let's harvest these up really quickly. But yes, so, oh my gosh, dinosaur. Oh, oh, have to get that out of my system. So today we should have the barn done and we will go look at that in just a moment. But I remembered at the last second that that's really exciting. Yay, barn is done, except for the fact that it is Tuesday and Marnie is not open on Tuesdays. So I'm thinking maybe we'll actually go and we will see if we can get the uh, kitchen upgrade even. I am willing to spend the money on getting the house upgrade started now if we have enough to offer to Robin and then we'll just have to get like our our cows and our sheep and whatever else can fit in the barn later. And I think that a good number, okay, the bok choy is still growing. I think unfortunately a good number of the things that we're looking for for our community center bundles in the artisan bundle, no not the artisan, in the animal bundle such as being able to get wool and large goat milk and large milk. I think you're only able to get like goats and sheep after you upgrade the barn again. So let's go see how much it costs to upgrade the barn again. And maybe just getting the barn fully deluxe upgraded and adding like lots and lots of preserves jars inside of it and adding lots of kegs inside of it will be one of our goals for what to do during winter because that would be a really fun thing to have in winter. And I just have this beautiful mental image in my head of preserve jars everywhere in the chicken coop and kegs gently brewing hops and ale and all sorts of things inside of the barn even though I don't eh, we could just pretend it's fancy fruit juice <laughs> I'm not a drinker myself but Pam Pam would probably appreciate a good pale ale and Shane really enjoys it too so I want to be friends with them and it'll just be like fruit juice <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and get this amaranth watered. That could definitely add in a lot more money. And we'll go take a peek at the barn. Oh my gosh, and I kind of wish if we have enough time and enough energy that we can dive into the caves again, you guys. Because the sooner we can get a fire essence, the sooner life is going to get very interesting since we can complete one of the major goals. Let's sell this and let's sell this cranberry. Let's sell this starred corn. Let's still sell this starred corn because we don't need... Um, 
those corn anymore since we've already put it into the bundle. But as soon as we can get the community center bundle for the broiler room done, once we have the fire quartz, then we'll have the mine carts repaired. And I think the mine carts will let us just like zip all over town. I'm actually gonna sell all of these cranberries today. I think the mine carts will let us zip all over town super quickly. So that would be amazing. All right, I'm gonna put away the maple syrup. Um, that's the wrong drawer. What about in here? This is also the wrong drawer. <laughs> I really could use that kitchen upgrade, couldn't I? Actually, that was the right one. Okay, yeah, let's go see how much the kitchen upgrade cost because if it's not that bad, I want it. I think it would be really fun to have that before the next year too. All right, let's come up and pet Noodle Doodles. Hey, Noodle Doodles, how you doing? And water this. And we're gonna put this cranberry. Uh, in fact, can I just maybe move this well let's leave the i figure like a line of preserves jars right here is actually fine in fact maybe that's what i'll work on today is we will make two more preserves jars um unless you can only put them like apart like this but i wanted like a line of preserves jars that went up against the coop i don't know why i just got that idea in my head now i want it and let's put some more ore on to smelt and there's our barn okay this is gonna be cool all right we need 15 there we go Oh my goodness, we have enough gold bars to upgrade something if we wanted to. And if we had the money to, I think it costs a lot of money to upgrade things. And there's not really, other than like maybe the pick, there's not really anything we need to upgrade yet. But <gasps> here we go, you guys. It's the big old barn. Look at it. Look how much space there is in here. I can't wait to fill it with animals. And that'll have to be tomorrow because unfortunately Marnie is not open today. Um, and yeah, I, I also want to kind of put a bunch of kegs in here too because it just looks like this would be good room for keg. Oh, and while we're here, let's just go ahead and get a chest down here like now because I have a feeling we're going to need one in here. So we'll just put that there. Leave the shrine to Grandpa alone. Ooh, the tar is ready. There's my meteorite too. I love my meteorite. It is so awesome. Let's come over here, gather this up. That is still an interesting looking tree. I'm keeping an eye on that tree because I'm suspicious about what it's going to grow into. All right, there we go. Probably nothing. <laughs> and let's come water these before I forget. And then we'll be done and I can just focus on other things for the day. All right, let's ride up to Robin's. What are you doing? down here my little adventurous marigold chicken very proud of you having a little spirit of adventure in that little wing set of yours all right put away the pine tar maybe you know what i could probably put away the mushrooms too and where's the pine tar go see i need a i need a house upgrade this is this is this is getting silly oops and while we're here put away the watering can and let's go talk to robin all right, there's my little dinosaur. Look at him. Oh, he's so cute. I love you so much. I can't believe we hatched a dinosaur. I'm still, I'm just thrilled about that. Absolutely thrilled. Oh, and there's a mushroom. Let's gather that up. Ooh, we got two gold star mushrooms. Those actually sell for a lot. I remember seeing that we got quite a bit from our daily reports. Oh, the little birdies. Hi guys. We got quite a bit from our daily reports um, for the mushrooms. All right, let's come in here. Guess what guys? Robin doesn't work on Tuesdays. Well, there's that. And you know what? Uh, let's go down. I don't think today is anyone's birthday. Yeah, no, because the 24th is actually George's birthday. I'm going to ride down into town just to make sure I do it at least once. And I think we're going to go to the mines. I don't think we have anything to waste. I know that I should probably be running around giving everybody gifts. But I really want to get the minecarts done. And the pros of getting the minecarts done. Oh, what's the quest today? Need a red snapper for an experiment. I don't have a red snapper. I'm sorry, wizard. Yep, and it's George's birthday tomorrow. So you know what? We're headed up. We are headed up. And we are going to go see if we can find the fire quartz inside of the cave system. And I'm kind of tempted just to eat my way back to health instead of sitting in the spa. But I have a feeling I would probably regret that because it'd be a use of things that we're definitely going to need to survive. Oh, there's Linus! Linus, hey! Some joker spray painted over my home during the night. It took hours to scrub it off this morning. <gasps> Linus, I am so sorry! That is awful! Have an egg! Have an egg! One egg for crying out loud. There we go. There we go. Let's give him an egg. 
This is a great gift. Thank you. There you go, Linus. You forget all about that horrible vandalism person that was probably Sebastian. I'm going to blame Sebastian. All right. And I'm going to pop in here, rejuvenate a little bit, and I will see you guys down in the mines where hopefully we'll be able to um, really start exploring. I should probably maybe try building some more bombs. I think getting some bombs built would be a good idea, don't you? Ah! Oh, there's Demetrius. All right. Let's see. We know a lot about nature thanks to science. But there's always a lot more to learn. Yes, that's true. And I have some corn, which he loves. Thank you. This is a very interesting specimen. Everybody loves my corn. I, I, if I had known that, I would have been giving everyone corn for like all of their summer gifts. And there's some worms. All right. So let's see what's in here. Just a little bit of stone. All right, Rose Stone, you stay here. I'll be right back. And let's see how far into the mines we can go today, you guys. We already have a staircase built. Um, I could keep the mushrooms as emergency food, actually. Uh, I'm going to put the corn away. Keep the mushrooms as emergency food. This can go away. Let's see. This and this can go away. I don't think I have anything more to make any more bombs out of. And we now have the obsidian sword, which might be... Oh, and let's leave the eggs here too. The obsidian sword might be very useful against really like strong enemies. So we're going to have to see about that. And we'll keep the staircase just in case we need it to be able to get down to deeper levels. So let's do this. All right, you guys ready? All right, let's see how far we can get. Let's see what we do. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh, creepy music. All right, let's keep you moving. All sorts of noises. It's like we're getting down into some sort of cave or volcanic, like volcanic cave level. And I might need to do a little bit more exploring. Come on. I need fire quartz. I wonder if fire quartz... Oh, there's a, there's a guy. We probably don't want to mess with that guy. So let's just keep moving. I, oh, an Omni Geode! And we got two of them! Oh dear, here's another one of these guys. Okay, I think this is okay. Oh, and he showed us the way down. Okay. Alright, so here's a normal quartz. I wonder how deep we have to go to get to the fire quartz. Alright, oh, and here's this guy. What does the obsidian sword do to him? That's not too bad, actually. I think the obsidian sword actually is extremely useful, so I might have to use that more often. Alright, let's get to the end of this tunnel. Oh, it's getting real now. Oh, 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 you back off, you little guy. Oh, we have to get rid of the, the rock on top of him. All right, and now, sorry, little one. <gasps> now we have the way down. Is there anything else over here? All right, there's another way down. And there's one of those guys, but we're just going to keep moving. So level 93. <gasps> fire quartz. Okay. Okay. Gunther, you do not get the fire quartz. We're going to... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm almost weak with excitement. Okay. Well, let's see what else we can manage to get just really quickly. But I can promise you guys we're going to be moving it out here soon. Let's see. All right. That's good. There we go. Got that guy out of here. Okay. We're going to have the minecarts repaired. Oh my gosh. This is going to be amazing. Whew. I am so excited. Okay. Okay. Sorry, Sirius just having one of those moments where you're like, this is gonna be good. What the heck are you? Get out of here. That was easy. Wow, that was really easy. I guess I need to just use this powerful sword more often. Jeez. All right. Um, should I even like stick around and try to get deeper? I guess we can try to get a little bit deeper just for a little bit though, because I want to fix the minecarts today. So we're only gonna stay like a few more minutes and then down we go, down the hatch or to, to the bundle completion area. We need to swing back by the house. Um, let's see, anything else here? Okay, there's the guy who shoots things at you. There's that guy too. Oh dear. All right, let's get this guy out of here. There, he's gone now. And anything over here? Man, that sword, I think we are gonna start using this sword more often. Because I'm able to get through these guys no time, thanks to it. They can't even attack me. There we go. Before I can get rid of them. Okay, so it is 8 p.m. Let's head out of here. Even though there are so many more... Well, actually, we're at level 94, aren't we? Okay. Maybe I'll use my stairs in just a second? Maybe I will use my stairs. Okay. Hey, get out of here, little guy. Okay, he is gone. Evil fire bat is gone. <gasps> I don't even have to use my stairs. And we're going to get down to level 95. Get out of here. Hello, everybody. Yeah, I know. Nope, thank you. Okay, thank you. What? That was an amazing critical hit. Okay, 
and let's go home you guys we're at level 95 we are at level 95 wow okay and we're gonna grab all this stuff we can leave behind some of this fiber and we can leave behind our weapons at least i love swinging the swords around but you know it's just they kind of get in the way when i'm just trying to do stuff since i carry my scythe all the time now so we'll leave that we'll leave this um i'll take the bat wing with me we have a gold bar we picked a gold bar up from somebody i didn't even notice till right now and you know what that means you guys whoops and let's leave the bombs here i always have to remember to leave my bombs uh you know what that means <laughs> That means we're we're going to go and we're gonna go complete the minecart bundle. Rose stone. This is this is a glorious moment, Rose Stone. Oh my goodness. I almost want to shake with excitement. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go down here. I can't believe we actually got a gold bar from some oh 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 Marnie, we can't. If word got out, it could undermine the position of authority in the town. Oh? Don't turn Marnie down. Come on, Lewis. You understand, don't you? Come on, Lewis. You're better than this. You care too much about your job, Lewis. There are other things in life, you know. <gasps> Marnie! But yes, I understand. I guess we'll have to keep us a secret. Oh, Marnie! <laughs> oh my goodness! Yeah. Siri, you overheard everything, didn't you? Yes, but I'll keep it a secret. Maybe I'm going to tell everyone. Why would it undermine? I guess I'll keep it a secret if it upsets you guys that much. Thank you, Siri. I won't forget this. You guys really should just... Maybe the right answer was to tell everyone. Why were you hiding there anyway? But Marnie said she understood. Oh, apparently I'm running for it. You heard nothing. Okay, that was adorable. So apparently the mayor and Marnie want their relationship together to stay a secret. I have absolutely no idea why. I think that's silly. They're perfect together. They should be happy together. Um, but we'll worry about that later. So in one foul swoop, you guys, we are going to be completing two beautiful bundles down here in this glorious abandoned section. All right. So geologist bundle, fire quartz. Boom! Bundle complete! Ah, oh, all the pretty gemstones. All right, what do we get for completing this? Five Omni Geodes. We will be taking those puppies over to Clint's tomorrow for sure. And then let's go ahead and grab this gold bar. Bundle complete. And that's the first time we've completed all the bundles. What do we get? Another furnace. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they're so excited. We are the Junimos, keepers of the forest. <gasps> it's repaired! You guys, it's repaired! Look at this! Look at this! This whole section is repaired! And apparently the minecarts are gonna be repaired? I thought I saw... I thought one of these stars were supposed to be repaired. Maybe not. But we didn't, you guys. We just completed our very first bundle. Like, our well, our very first set of bundles, I should say. And I am really happy. And apparently, the minecarts are going to be repaired. We'll have to check on that tomorrow. And this is fantastic. This is absolutely fantastic. What a day. What a day. Wow. Well, you know, I think I'm going to leave it there. So I'll see you guys tomorrow when we'll see how the minecarts are repaired. We'll see if we can afford a bunch of cows and goats and sheep to put into our barn, if we can even get any of those. And we will go and see if we can get the kitchen upgrade or the barns upgraded. And just generally try to continue building up our beautiful town. And I am just so happy. This is truly one of my favorite games, you guys. And I'm so, so happy to share the stories and the adventures with you. It wouldn't be what it is if I couldn't share it with you. So that very sentimental speech aside, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Oh my gosh, there they go. Oh, I think they're repairing the minecarts, you guys. This is going to be amazing.